fried mozzarella. Cheers. Got my favorite horchata. Look at this thing. Oh my gosh. One last look. People have been in the pool since so early this morning. Focus? Yeah, it is. Got our coffee. Cheers. Cheers. We're going to Epcot. No, wait, where are we going? Epcot. Epcot. <laughs> so it's really early. Eric had to go to school today, so we checked out at like everything was out of the room and in the car before 8 a.m. All right, so now we're going to the bus to go to Epcot. It's 9.30 maybe? And they open at 11. 9.32. <gasps> Look at us, such early people today. You never see this. Coffee everything. We are ready to go. And we ate. We had breakfast, like, well, a little breakfast. Yeah. Like an hour ago. It just said Epcot and then it went away. Is this Epcot? Yeah. It is? Home bus to ourselves. And we got Pluto. All right, so we just got dropped off by that Pluto bus. There's literally not a single other person at any of the bus stations. It feels so weird. Like, it feels like we're the only ones at Epcot right now. It's 10 10. The park actually opens at 11, but they let you in a little bit sooner. Nothing else is really open. So many people are running. Not running. <laughs> well, well, they have a destination. So basically, if you go that way, that's towards Soren. So anyone that's trying to get on Soren first is going that way. And then this way is Test Track Mission Space, Frozen. So definitely lots more people are going to the left than to the right. Nobody seems to care about Soren that much anymore. Construction, always. Hopefully it'll be done soon. Does anybody know when they're actually gonna be done with this? There's already a long line for Test Track. It's not even 11 o'clock yet. This is all of the test track line. I just saw the guy that had the end of line sign. Now he's gone. Because he's over there. <laughs> oh my gosh. Where else would we start besides Canada? Who cares if it's early in the morning we're getting flaming on. Look at this. Seafood pot pie. Don't know how I feel about it. I'm gonna try it. <laughs> My favorite. I'm gonna try it. Just try it. It's like there's liquid in it. So it's. Did you explain what it was? Seafood pot pie. You just have the potatoes and take a piece of seafood. There you go. You got shrimp. You got. Yeah. Mom, I don't know if I can eat this. Try it. No, what is that? It's seafood. It's gonna smell oh, like that. that. Eat the mashed potatoes with it. Someone said it was really good. Ooh, I got a nice big piece here. Oh, look at this. Look at what is in. Here we go. This is good. Fishy. Wow. I don't like it. They give you big pieces in here. It's like the consistency is just. It's very liquidy and like seafoody. I don't like it. Thank you. Greece. Mom is gonna try the griddled cheese. Maybe I'll have a bite of it. It's just, I don't know, pistachios and honey freaks me out. But it stamps off one of your first thing on the list to get that little special surprise. So. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 
This is the griddled cheese. Doesn't look too appetizing to me, but mom will probably like it again. Then we have our wine flight. These are the different wines that we have. There's a white, a rose, and a red. It says Greece on it. Show it. Let's see what the white is like. Smells good. Smells good. It's like a, you know, Grigio. This is rosé. I like rosé. It's a little perfumey. It's in the red. Very, very, very dry. Exactly like it says. But it's not bad. The red smells better than it tastes, but aftertaste-wise, I think the red is my favorite. Oh, wow. Now that the dryness is gone, like it? It's okay. Mm. That one's good, right? It smells good. It actually. Oh. It's very dry. You make me too. Look at my back. Look at my back. You're all wet. Okay. Look at this. Oh. Looks very strange. All right, ready? Let's try griddled cheese. I like it. <laughs> you don't think anything. Let's so do it out. I like it. You're supposed to eat it when it's warmer because now it's not as warm. I'm a big cheese person. I love cheese. I don't like the honey and the cheese. I think it's a good combination. We're gonna try the teriyaki chicken bun. I have a feeling it's gonna be like the hamburger dumpling sliders that are in Pandora. All right, what better place to try this? It looks good. I don't know if you guys watch the Animal Kingdom vlog, but this is exactly what the cheeseburger sliders The taste mm -hmm. is probably really good. Oh my god. Yeah. Oh, look at this. It's like a chicken teriyaki chili. It has like peppers on my... This is really good. Is that, is that your favorite This is my so favorite far? so far. Oh. Boy. All right, so at the stand when you first walk into America, it's called Pops and Barley. We got this cider, I forget what it's called. It's coffee, look at the name. It is right here. It's Bold Rock Roast Coffee Hard Cider. That's what it is. You can see that. We got some fried mozzarella and some limoncello margaritas and we are in Italy. Oh my gosh! Fried ravioli. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wow. And the sauce is really good. I don't know what kind of sauce it is, but it's not. Yeah. It's like in between vodka and tomato because it's not too tomato. -y. These are really, really good. And they're not really full, they're kind of hollow, which is good because like, it doesn't fill you up too right. much, you know? I'm gonna have room for everything else. <laughs> This is the paella from Spain. So delicious. <laughs> this is my country.
Is this real life? I'm already drinking my drink. I'm kind of drunk. So Shane told me that there was a wild cherry chauffeur offer and I had to come get it because I've never had it. Cheers. <laughs> Is it really good? It's really so good. Eh? It's better than the grapefruit one? I think it's it's a close tie. It's a tie. I'll try it. No, I like this one better. Do you? I was gonna say that, but I it literally tastes like a cherry lollipop. We hopped online for Frozen. We're drinking our drinks online, and they gave a little less. He drank less than me. He's thirsty. It says 25 minutes. Shane went on it before, and it was 25 minutes. I'll say. Happy summer snow day from me to you. inside of Mexico the last couple times we were here because there's always a line. Where do you guys think we're going? Oh, we're going this way. Psych, we're going right to, oh my, look at the line. Oh, yeah. Got my favorite horchata, my agave straws. So we just ran back into Shane in the UK, totally unplanned. He had this like really pretty looking green drink and I was like, ooh, what is this? And he was like, try it. So I tried it and it literally tastes like the green melon soda that they used to have that you used to be able to try samples of in that like area by the globe. Uh, Club Cool, Club, Club Cool? I think so. Something Club like something. That. What's it called? Coca-Cola Co 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 product store, yeah. I'll insert a picture. <laughs> yeah. It's like a melony kind of drink. It's called the something dragon. I'll find it. Just fill it up, so put it in and have a look at it. Look at these guys. Look, she realized. Hi. <laughs> you ready to eat? Mm -hmm. Alright, it's time for dinner. Our table is ready. This is, wait, there, wait, wait. We could go anywhere. No, uh, no, no, don't go anywhere because the right, don't go the right one. Look. Nice, how did you do that? Eric, it's going to it, don't touch it. Hold <gasps> it. I'm <laughs> in the bushes. Oh, we got it. Hit it, as hard as before. <laughs> like, what is with me? Wait. 